Hey, this is Tiny Trail and Chrono, inviting you back to Let's Play Fire Emblem. Last time left off, uh, we were in a conversation with, uh, apparently Florina's sister. Fiora! Which is like Florina, except... You know. Hey, Delindus, what are you doing? I was investigating by yourself. Right, uh... You're in the sky, and they... whatever. Made her cry. Let's see, clearly, nah, travel better. Join us for a fight against commun- I mean, fight for righteousness. And I think now we might be able to talk to her with Roy, I don't even know. I guess not, just a uh, formality that she says, I guess. Let's see, from here, what do we want to do? We don't want to uh, have Matthew die out there. Uh, yeah, let's, yeah, let's go bring you back. Let's see what we can do. Uh, Hector, you could, hmm. Yeah, I guess Raven would be the better choice here. And just one shot some. Speed that up a bit. And uh, Lucius. Uh, yeah, you can take a hit. And possibly it won't even hit anyway, so. Uh, eh, I guess not. I mean, I guess so, I don't know. Dorcas. Uh, Hector. Someone. Yeah, come on. Yes, I'm gonna get this hit off. And. We got another torch, which we apparently aren't using because I'm stupid. Twelve. Eh, hmm. Let's see, what to do from here? If we attack, then... Ye yeah, I guess it's not that bad. Steel Axe and Iron Lance and we actually dodge it thanks to his uh, yellow attire. Canis, I guess you can just stay right there. Darts, a man, pal, Migo in aqua colored clothes. Let's see, then let's go bring Fiora. And Florina, yeah, their names are just basically mixed up without the L in the end. Uh, Oswin. Yeah, we can take him out. And Oswin levels up, because we always need more crit level with Oswin. Let's see, Hollywood. Steel, iron, yeah, I could probably take you out, but then, eh, actually he's a pirate, so it doesn't really matter. And once more to the horse. There we go. And we're just getting torches up the asses. That sounded really fucking odd. I don't really want to send Guy out too far, and I want to scout up here. Yeah, I knew it was not a pirate. Hmm. Eh, I guess just bring Urk down here with the rest of the people, and end our turn. Goes to attack, and he misses, while Elliewood gets a nice critical off. And gigantic back leap for no reason. Dodge, flux, and once more the crits. Moving through the fog and attacking with Iron Lance. Dodge and yeah, I hit. And we can actually finally finish this guy off, but before he dies, he decides to actually hit me. It's really annoying. Uh, yeah. More and more Cavaliers coming our way. They're taunting me is what they're doing. 
Oh yeah, they can use Cavaliers. I can't use Cavaliers. They're shooting at me. I don't have a hand axe out. Yeah, they're just spawning everywhere. Let's see. Um, we could try Lucius. Uh, I don't want to put him in harm's way, though. Actually, let's bring Raven down here. Iron uh, sword. And we can finish this guy off right here. Dodge. And once more. Apparently, every weapon's the size of a horse. Finish you off. Now let's see, uh, Dorcas, Steel, hmm. I actually might want to have Hector on this one. Or not. Or, yeah, it doesn't really matter. Come on! Low percent chance the hit actually works. Chris, for he is Hector the Great, and Noble, and, you yeah, know, whatever else. Let's wait, apparently you don't have the torch, uh, oh, but Elliewood has a torch. So let's use that. Let's see, anything to worry about? Mm, actually, not too bad right here. Let's go have Canis go finish this guy off. <laughs> or not, apparently, seeing as how he's fast. And, uh, hmm, if we go over here, we can... Yeah, I guess not, so... No, not rescue, that would have been bad. And steel axe. Let's see, from here, we could... Yeah, let's go down with them. Uh, I'm pretty sure someone else has a torch on them. Ah, of course he does. Yeah, that's basically it for here. Another dodge and another kill. Wow, I could have died. I probably still will. No, two damage. Oh, also, uh, when you use a torch, the, uh, your, uh, sight gets reduced each turn after you use it, so keep that in mind. Kind of spin sky off. Really long animation again. There we go. Uh, probably would have been a better idea if I sent someone up there. Wait a minute, uh, no, I guess no bonus. Actually, in the C, he gets a bonus. So, let's go use that to our advantage. And I think we can probably finish this guy off a guy, and I'm right. Okay, well, things are looking up from here. And I probably just jinx myself by saying that, but I don't care. Goes a torch, scatter area out. Uh, not too bad actually. Uh, let's bring up Elliewood item and let's use a torch. Okay, so now we basically have a good chunk of the area covered. Uh, I'm pretty sure Uhai is within this uh, thicket over here. And okay, they're done there. Then's over here. And move a little closer. Let's see, uh, Urk. And apparently can't finish him off one shot. Less of a critical? I guess not. Okay, let's bring Osman over here. Actually, we can probably just, yeah, attack him with Javelin. We got a Lightning Tome. That's, I guess, decently okay. Let's see, you can bring you over here. Iron Sword. And finish you off. With a critical. 
Oh, I get it. He distracts him with his sword. Right. Anyway, let's spring loose over down here. And... No, not item. Be over here. And... Uh, Alright, I didn't move them. They're not going to move at all. Another pirates. And another slash. And a weapon level increase. Miss. And lightning. Wolf Beal time? Yes. And I got about 20 seconds, so hopefully I can make through the enemy phase. And I do. So anyway, this is Time Trail and Chrono signing for Let's Play Fire Emblem. Goodbye, thanks for watching.